Would you rather flip one house that pays you a million bucks? And then guess what happens with that million dollars? You're going to spend it. Yep. And guess what happens when you spend it? It's gone. It's gone. It disappears, you know, versus like, hey, instead of that, I'd rather buy the rental property that pays me day in and day out. Doesn't matter if I'm sick, doesn't yep. matter if I feel like this or don't feel like it's going to keep paying me. So, but that also, if you have, if you're making 10,000 a month on, in passive income from real estate, even if you don't have the million dollar net worth right then, you will have it because prices go up, loans get paid down. And so you're going to get it anyway. So yeah. becoming a millionaire becomes automatic yeah. when you focus on the cash flow. 100%, on the pipeline. dude. It's like you get the best of both worlds. Yep. You know, the appreciation is coming at some yep. point and you can never really control that anyways. So yep. why would you? try and only invest for that when you can do both. Get clarity on what it is you actually want. Yeah. Is it a million dollars or is it a lifestyle that a millionaire lives? That's like four hour work week. He says, that, like, do you want to be a multimillionaire or you just want to have the lifestyle of a multimillionaire? Mm. I think we just want the lifestyle of it. Yeah. So, and you get that from cash flow. You get that from whether real estate or business or whatever.